boys and girls, welcome back to the most amazing, most, uh, well it's just a normal, regular old video, it's not amazing at all. Um, okay, so as you know, we are building a electric dirt bike or electric pit bike. Um, uh, the, the pit bike that we got, uh, the donor bike, was in really bad shape, so we are bringing up uh, we are doing a restoration of most of the parts. So in the last few videos we've been painting the frame, painting the plastics and today what we're going to do is uh, we are going to use um, vinyl wrap with the carbon fiber pattern to enhance or bring up the highlights in the, the plastics. Um, as in the last videos I will show you how to do two parts, the other um, parts are exactly the same. Now, bear in mind, the way I'm doing this, I'm doing it quick and dirty, okay? So, uh, I am going to be um, laying on the, the vinyl, and then, once it's laid on, I am gonna cut it with uh, exactly that. Now, there's a problem with that approach, which is, um, if you then later remove the carbon fiber, you are going to have a scratch exactly where you cut it. Now, I don't care about that because I am not going to be removing the carbon fiber for one and uh, if I am going to remove the carbon fiber, I will probably be painting it again, so I, I don't care. And this is much easier to do. This way it's, it's so much easier and so much faster. So, okay, let's get started. Uh, first, you have to make sure that your parts are clean. These are pretty clean because they, are, they were just painted yesterday. So, yeah, we're fine there. Then you get regular old um, carbon fiber vinyl type thingy and we are going to stick it on there. Now I am also not using a template. I am doing this um, by eye. I don't, I don't know the expression in English when you do something and you just eyeball it. That's, that's the expression. I am eyeballing it, so, um, because I don't feel like spending a lot of time on this particular process, so yeah. Now, with carbon fiber vinyl, one thing you need to know is that it's pretty hard to lay down if you don't use heat. It will start to curl and get all wrinkly and get all bubbly and... So you need to use a heat gun, regular old heat gun in the setting one. Do not use setting two, or you'll um, you'll ruin your work. So I am sure there are a lot of a lot of other ways to do this, and probably better ways. Um, the way I feel works best for me is if I press down the carbon fiber, the line in the carbon fiber, and then I work towards the edges, um, removing all the creases. Now, once you start applying heat to the vinyl, it's really very easy to, to form into place. Now, obviously, you need to make sure that your paint is dry and it's a good quality paint. Otherwise, when you do this, um, we are going to then remove the parts that we are going to be cutting off if you don't have a good quality paint or your paint is not dry enough, what's going to happen is you're going to rip the paint right out of the part. And obviously, we don't want that to happen. Yeah, so this is the process. Now, I'm going to skip ahead to the point where we already have the carbon fiber in place. So, 
let's say, pick a random number. Uh, this will be a 15 second time lapse. Starting right now. So here we have it, um, so now what I'm going to do is with the blade, sharp blade, I'm going to follow the lines on the plastic to cut out and dirty we get to highlight the features of the plastics and now it doesn't look so damn bland we are then um, after this is finished we are going to um, clear coat it so it blends in with the, so the carbon fiber blends in with the color 
Now let's do that one, exact same process. What can happen if the paint is not dry enough or if it's a bad quality paint or if you haven't sanded the parts correctly I can clearly see that part is shiny is that when you pull the carbon fiber off it will take a little bit of the paint I am not especially worried about that because this is under the seat so I don't really care however if it was in one of these parts that would be that would suck we would have to repaint the whole thing. Here we have it, um, once plain looking orange part, now look a little bit better because of um, a little bit of carbon fiber that we wrapped in them uh, to make them stand out a little bit more and uh, so yeah, I like, I like the finished result. Um, okay, and we even managed to save the part that uh, we ripped a little bit of paint off uh, since we had uh, duct tape in there, we used it as mask and we painted it again. So yeah, it's still drying, So, but we managed to save it and it looks pretty cool. Okay, so in the next video, what we're going to be doing is uh, giving this uh, a clear coat um, and hopefully uh, mount them in the bicycle, in the motorcycle frame. So you can see how it looks once, um, once in, the, in the bike. So yeah, hey, thanks for watching. Watch the next one. See you later.